Hi, this is Marv Johnson and Dick Riley, and we'd like to welcome you to the initial broadcast of PATTV, the station that will follow the life of Patrick here and give you expert analysis of his every move. Now, right off the bat, what we're seeing is a classic attempt to avoid waking up and facing the day ahead. Marv, he is historically a late riser who has about a 257 average of showing up to class on time. Pitiful numbers. It makes it even tougher to get up when you're awakening from a good dream. And judging from the blanket tent he's got pitched down there, I'd say it was a doozy. <laughs> you can say that again, Marv. He's got one heck of a teepee pitched down there. Is this a dream? And it looks like Pat has finally come to his senses, Dick. I know, Marv. Pat is really losing his mind. He's going to need to pull together in the second half of his life. Where did you come from? Well, Pat, I'm guessing that after watching so much sports, something in your brain just snapped. Ain't that a shame. Well, what am I supposed to do now? Pat, what I'd recommend, just go about your daily business. You won't even know we're here. It's a terrible technique, Mark. Just get up in there, circular motion, really fight that flat. The score, gingivitis one, Pat nothing. <laughs> And it looks like it's that girl down at the end of the hall that Pat has a thing for. My oh my, things are about to get interesting, Marv. The stage is set for an epic showdown here. Man and woman pitted against one another. Pride and the possibility of future fornication are on the line. High stakes. Pat is going to have to come up big in the clutch here, and that is not his strong point. Now we've got a very special on the field report from our own Rick Smiley. Not Dick Riley, Rick Smiley. Two different people. Are you with us, Rick? Thanks, Mark. This is Rick Smiley reporting live from the scene of an epic struggle. In this very stall is Patrick Schulze fighting a war with his bowels. Essentially, competition. Mark, I think I can taste it. You guys don't want to come down here, it is horrible. What is this? Paper ripping? Maybe a flush? Hey! hey. Up. You're just completing what are you guys doing? Bells. My name is Rick Smiley from PDG. You're here to shake my hand and ask me hey. questions after I just did Slow this? Down. Hey, you got the Oh, for those of you watching at home with young viewers, we would like to apologize for that use of explicit language. Just disgraceful. Once again, we here at PATTV would like to offer our sincerest apologies for whatever you have just witnessed. Yeah, so uh, let, let's check back in. Let's check back in with Rick. Rick, are you still with us? I'm here, Marv, and I am thoroughly disgusted with what I've witnessed here today. You're referring to the unsportsmanlike display that Pat just put on? No, I'm talking about the quick peek I took into the stall during the break. Pat may not be much of a role model, but let me tell you, he can sure punish some porcelain. This is Rick Smiley, signing out. Nice work out there. Rick. Let's check back in with Pat. Oh, you think you're here for good? You think you're here for good? Well, you're freaking not. Uh, <laughs> oh, oh, this serious? Oh, my God. <laughs> but seriously, Pat, as long as your life is dominated by sports, we're not going anywhere. Sports, huh? <laughs> Marv, I do not believe my eyes. It appears Pat has begun to knit. And now he's watching the view. I mean, Whoopi is so right. Why doesn't Barbara Walters see that? This has gone on too far. Wait, it's, is he painting his this, nails? Oh, okay, it's time to go. Yeah, I, go. I, I'm done. What? We're, we're leaving. You serious? Yes. I am so happy about this. Welcome to The View on Pat. This is Baba Walters, and I'm here with Joy, Whoopi, Sherry, and Elizabeth. First order of business, Pat's massive morning election. Thoughts, ladies? No!